Hey guys, I got two GameCube motherboards here. Showing differences in them. This is the DOL 101 motherboard. It has its regular board built into it, so it doesn't have that little square board about this size inside of it. I mean, underneath it. Usually this board is in the DOL 001, but this one has it built into it, so it doesn't require this board. You can see there, all the regulators are here for converting for each type of voltage for the GameCube. <coughs> now, this can save you some space in a GameCube fairly well, and you don't have to do any wiring, unlike this board right here, you'd have to wire each one of these up to a board, like this one. This is the DOL001, which requires this regulator board. Now, this one doesn't have these here, you can see. Instead, it has little pin slots. This part on the back is supposed to slide into this little port here, but you'd have to wire it up if you want to have it like save some room you know and good thing about this board is that it can be cut down quite a lot you, you don't need all this space here this board you can't really cut down that much because of the regulators in the way <clears throat> but this one does save you a lot of wiring and it's really good for beginners this board is more for the expert type class that good at cutting down boards and wiring them up to the direct pins on the board. Um, this one, all you have to really wire up is the the power and the audio and video, and you're done. And But this board also, well, both of the boards require a uh, voltage regulator for any, like, screens that don't support it, like the PS1 screen uses about 7.4 volts can go up to like 8.5 ish but these the regulators on the GameCube go up to like 12 volt, 5 volt um, 1.9 I think and 3 point something <coughs> so yeah you need to make your own voltage regulator for the PS1 screen if you're going to use batteries like 14.8 uh, volt or something like that. If you're using 7.4 volt batteries then you don't need the regulator of course because that can run directly to the PS1 screen. Um, here's some differences in the on off switch slash fan between the two boards. This one is for the DOL um, 001. It has its own little chip which connects the... It's, it acts just like a switch. You, know, you press the button it sends the current of electricity through. When the button's off, it doesn't send the current through. Um, this one, I unscrewed it, but there's no board. It's just direct wiring inside of the plastic, so there's no board on top. This one is from the DOL 101, the board with the regulator. This board. So yeah, it's a little bit different. A little bit different, of course. Um. Now, if you're going to use a Wiki Fusion, which lots of portabilizers want to use that because it saves you a lot of room from having to use this giant disk drive here. Check out that thing, it's huge compared to the board. It's like way too tall. But yeah, the Wiki Fusion, it uh, doesn't work on, what is it, um, IPA 1.0 for the North American GameCubes. And the, what is it called, the DOL001, if you open it up, sometimes they have, you can't see it in the video. I wish this camera was better. But it says right above this chip right here, right where my finger's at, it would say the um, the board number. This board is DOL CPU 10. If it's 10, then it most likely has IPA 1.0, which doesn't work with Wiki Fusion. Um, if it's higher than 10, then it most likely does work. 
like this board right here you can see it kind of this one's CPU 60 DOL CPU 60 and that would most likely work because it has the newer IPA version which is 1.1 that's the newest version so it's kind of a cool trick so find out the IPA version it's not always 100% accurate but it can help um, that's pretty much it the difference is of course there's a this one's only got one audio and video this one has like the digital audio video which I don't know I don't know why you'd really use that <coughs> um that's about it right now hope you like the differences I like this board for beginners of course and this board's for the experts who are good at cutting slimming down the boards a lot that's it